Hello beautiful people and welcome to a fantastic episode in which I'm gonna show you a huge trick how to get a lot of points obviously for free in the Mightiest Governor event and we will gonna have to specifically focus on this third day in which you are getting points for farming resources also on top you see you get 1000 points for spinning the wheel and first of all let me show you my wheel because here you see obviously I done just 60 pulls meaning in other words Yes, that's 60,000 points, but if we have a look at my total points right now, you see me at 829,350 points. And this number will gonna play a role in a second because I'm gonna actually perform this in this episode in order for you to see that it actually works. So first of all, where is this much? It's still farming for hours. Okay, it's fine. Where is this much? Still farming like five hours. Where is this much? Still farming one and a half hours. Where is this much? It's still farming five hours, but have a look at this. Where is this much? Boy, he's just facing my farming account. I actually have two of them. Because the huge trick is you can get resources by attacking different castles. And when you bring them home, they're going to count as gathered resources, which is an awesome trick. And we actually want to attack this one over here. Therefore, I'm going to move my match a bit more up. Let's have a look at the march because you see here I have zero load. There are no resources inside, so pretty important to see. Let me send briefly out all my marches because I don't want them to be killed. So we do this very, very fast. Send this one here. Let's say this one here. And the last march we're also going to send out to some tiles. Okay, so right now I can attack my castle. So let's do that and let's get all these resources out. And bring my match back to the base and see if indeed resources gathered by attacking a castle will actually going to count as gathered resources. So, let's do that. There we go. I also would like to add in here, super important, take a cavalry march because the cavalry actually marches a bit more faster. So the units are down and when I click now on my march details, you can see the load of resources going up and up and up and I think I have a limit of roughly around the nine minutes right now we're gonna see in a second so let's get all these resources and then we're gonna bring our match back home and obviously beautiful people you're gonna see that this method works but you should also take advantage of this method and do this one day before because if you have a look here right now at my farming marches uh, this march, which is farming a tie, obviously it has a load of 3.7 million simply because I sent that much automatically to farm a tile and that tile is exactly as big but what you should and must do is actually increase the amount of units to maximum because you will be able to farm a tile then send it to another tile then send it to another tile and maybe at one point if you still have not reached the reset for the day in which you are getting points for gathering then stop that march somewhere on the field. Uh, we can have a look at this march can actually only carry 9.8, which is probably also my limit. This one uh, can carry far more. Uh, this one also it's set for 3.7 because that's exactly the tile which is gathering and this is kind of best march for farming. Good, let's have a look how far are we now. We are at 4 millions right now, so it's kind of half of it um, of the resources which I can, which I will get from this castle. And then obviously I won't interrupt this recording, but I will gonna indeed speed it in order to see me getting my march back to my base, which is by the way far away because uh, now the end game is kind of open. Yeah, so definitely gonna have some interesting videos pretty soon when it comes down to fighting for the big capital here in the middle. So let's go back to my little guy here, which is still farming by the way from another castle. Let's see how far are we? Okay, still gonna take a little bit. I'm gonna speed actually a little bit this process. And by the way, my farm still has plenty of resources in it. So good, let's have a look now. How far are we? Almost there, almost there, people. Two million left of resources to be taken uh, off my uh, farm account. 
So we are almost there, it's still going up, let's take all the possible resources and then bring our match back home. There we go, here we have reached 9.5 million, therefore I have to stop, there's no point to keep attacking, but you know what, now we're gonna pull our, our match back home and I won't stop this video, quite the contrary, I'm actually gonna speed it up in order for you to see actually I'm not interrupting this process, so 9.5 million, they are marching my way. And this is the amount of resources which I have. And let's see what's the marching time. 18 minutes. So I'm definitely going to speed this up to X10, X20, something like that. In order for this to be absolutely super fast. Let's wait for it. So we are almost there. So 40 seconds till uh, this march reaches a position close to my base. I didn't drag it directly into my base. Again, we can have a look at this march is being out and not being pulled into my base, okay? And again, I'm gonna show you the points which I have right now, which also obviously nothing changed. So 829,350 points, that's what I have. And uh, here we are, 15 seconds away. And you know what, I'm just gonna drag them directly home. There we go. And here you can see again the amount of resources, 9.5 million resources. You see also the resources. And they are entering my base right now. And let's have a look at the points. And let's see if we got some points out of this. So, 924,476 points. Again, you can see it also in ranking. So, beautiful people, yeah. If you would like me to do these kind of episodes in which I'm gonna show you tips and tricks regarding the Edge of Empires Mobile, let me know in the comments. Obviously, super important. Support what supports you back. Which is 100% free because, yeah, you should definitely subscribe to this channel. Obviously, watch my videos till the end. Share this channel with your friends. Thank you very much for watching. And I'm gonna catch you in the next awesome episode. Ciao, ciao, ciao.